Hey guys, today I want to give you a short introduction about infrared camouflage. At first, what is infrared? We have the electromagnetic spectrum and it's really big. The visible sector is only really small. So the visible one is the one we can see with our naked eyes and also with cameras like this one. Then beyond that on one side we have the ultraviolet light, which can cause sunburn for example, but we cannot see it with our eyes. Some animals are capable to see it with their eyes. And then we also have the infrared, which is a near infrared for example, uh, which is really close to the color red. And we have the far infrared, which is also included in some thermal devices. So this is for like spotting an animal by the heat signature or a human by its heat signature. Now, to make the infrared visible, I have got this generation one night vision device. This can be used in daylight like we have right now. So this one can see the visible light and also the infrared. So now when you look at my pants and my jacket, you can see they look like normal colors when you look at it with the visible spectrum. But now with infrared, you can see the color difference. Now I can even show a harder example. I've got this pants and it looks almost like the same color like my jacket and the pants I'm wearing right now. It's even from the same brand, but you can see they use a different dye. So this is really dark. Yeah, how is this cost? In colors, you have something that can change the appearance in the infrared sector. So you can add something that makes it darker or you can add something that makes it lighter from the color but for the visible, you cannot really see the difference. For military clothing, often the colors are important to have infrared color because you think or you always have the option that there's an enemy who is looking for you with night vision devices. For backpacks, you can often use like backpack covers, but not all of them are with infrared colors. This, for example, is with infrared color. You can, so you can see a pattern and without the cover, the color is still really nice, but it's bright. Yeah, now there are different thoughts about that. Um, you can see around me this everything green and the green stuff in the leaves, the chlorophyll in German, uh, is reflective. So it's bright in the infrared sector. So when you wear something that is bright, usually it can work really good. Now when you are like in a different area where there's more mud or maybe more dead leaves and and things like that you will need some contrast and a darker reflecting thing could be better or more like absorbing uh, clothing but all depends so here this is also a nice example this one is a, a 3d leaf suit which hunters often use with one brown side and one mainly green side it's multicolor and invisible, but you can see in infrared, the contrast is more or less not that good. But it's relatively bright. Maybe it even fits quite good to the background right now because here everything is green. When you use something more like military grade, you will have an infrared pattern where you can see a clear pattern. And this will work like a normal camouflage pattern. So you have bright spots and dark spots and, and with this you will conceal and you will destruct your silhouette and your yeah your appearance <laughs> yeah fleece jackets and things like that often are really bright like that it's um, yeah one color only and in the visible sector it also works relatively good since it's a nice green but in the infrared, it's really bright with no contrast. In the German military, we use the flectan, and normally all these things are with infrared colors. So you can see a really good pattern to be also camouflaged when someone has got night vision. The cool thing about infrared is that you can use light, for example, like this headlamp does. And with the normal eye, you cannot see that light, but with 
all night vision devices, you will be able to see that light. So when someone is looking for you and you use infrared light, he will also see you. Also a cool thing about infrared is there are these uh, infrared patches. So they, do, they reflect infrared light only from someone who is sending light to here. Yeah, so with infrared light, this will be shining like cat eyes on your bicycle. So the, these often have been used to differentiate friends from enemies. Because when only the good ones have night vision and these patches on their helmet, then only the good ones will be the ones with these reflecting things. But for that, you have to send out active infrared light and everyone with night vision will be able to see you. So these things are more or less yeah, out of time. Okay guys, that was the rough introduction of infrared camouflage. I was not talking about night vision devices. It's a really big topic. So it just was like a rough idea about infrared camouflage. Okay, thanks for watching. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you like. And I'm looking forward to be watched by you again. <laughs> Bye.